last job on Tachanka was intense. I tried providing air support, but the sky was so full of Cerberus, it was like someone kicked a hornet's nest. Too bad about Tarquin. I was starting to like him. Commander? Enjoy your day. Good to see you. Shepard, Eve ready for travel to Tuchanka. How's she doing? No fever currently. Heart rate elevated. Likely stress. Eating appropriately. Could use another blanket. Something soft. Prefer to let her recover fully before synthesizing cure. My medical recommendation. My people don't have time for that. Her opinion, somewhat different. You care about her. My patient. My responsibility. Found her at STG base. Three doctors injured trying to restrain her. Undid arm restraints. Didn't resist when she grabbed me. Promised to help her. She said, please. Nice talking with you, Morden. We'll be here if you need me. Continuing to study Shroud in meantime. All hands, full stop! Hostiles detected at the landing coordinates. J-1, 
Joker, what have you got? Sensors show a Reaper parked at the Shroud facility. No way you're gonna be able to land a shuttle there. Get everyone assembled in the war room. I want eyes on the Shroud. Aye, aye, ma'am. New form of Reaper, Shepard. Using Shroud to poison Tuchanka's atmosphere. Problematic. They wanna fight! They just got one. Primarch, we're gonna need your help. That could be difficult. Our losses on Palavin have been catastrophic. You said you'd help. It's time to deliver. What is it you need? A combined attack. Your people hit the Reaper with an airstrike. Rex, at the same time, your soldiers will be attacking from the ground. Together, you can draw it away from the tower. Yes, distraction. Small team can reach Shroud facility, finish synthesizing cure. We'll need Eve to come with us. And it's now or never. Now. The genophage ends today. Commander, incoming message marked urgent. I'll put it in the comm room for you. Dalatras. Commander Shepard, we know you've reached Tuchanka. And by now, I imagine Morden Solus has proposed using the Shroud. Are you spying on us? Hardly. The Shroud is the only viable course of action open to you. Commander, you can't allow the diplomatic pressures of this war to cloud your judgment. Do you honestly believe curing the Genophage will end in lasting peace? We have to give the Krogan that chance. We can't condemn an entire race to extinction based on what might happen. What will happen is the Krogan will reproduce out of control. We uplifted them specifically for their violent nature, not their diplomatic skills. Another war is inevitable. What do you want, Dalatras? Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you were planning couldn't be done. Morden will likely detect this malfunction and repair it. But if you ensure that he doesn't, then the cure's viability will be altered just enough so that it fails. No one will notice the change. You mean trick the Krogan? They need not be any the wiser. Let Erdnot Rex believe you fulfilled your promise. Morden would never stand for that. How you deal with him is up to you, Commander. We can provide you our very best scientists to build the Crucible, and the full support of our fleets. If I sabotage the cure. Think about it, Commander. The choice is yours. I've ordered the clans to assemble at the Hollows. It's our sacred meeting ground. We'll land there and take an armored convoy against the Reaper. This will be the defining moment of Krogan history. Krogan history filled with defining moments, most bloody. Hope this one better. Commander, you seem troubled.
There's just a lot on the line. I want this to go well. Have faith. No matter the adversity we face, some moments are destined to happen. This is one of them. Rex, it's Reeve. The Reapers are already at the hollows. Come out with guns blazing. Hang on tight. We're heading in. away from the female. I'll sort out what's happening with the other clan. Everyone pick your targets and keep an eye on our six. Now move! Here they come! songs about this someday. Reaper blood has finally soaked our soil. We have to get to the Shroud. The airstrike is on its way. Female safe, Shepard. Vitals are strong. What's a Solarian doing here? Nobody said anything about this. Multiple Krogan. Problematic. Who are you? Erdnot Reed. Brood brother to our illustrious leader. <laughs> Reeve and I share the same mother and nothing else. For which I'm thankful. I remember what it means to be a true Krogan. <laughs> we flay our enemies alive and drown them in a geyser of their own blood. We don't invite them into our home. There's no time for this. Whatever grudge you have against Salarians ends right now. As long as it involves a bullet in his head, time for some payback. Stand down, Reeve. The Solarian is with me. You can stay here and let old wounds fester as Krogan have always done. Or you can fight the enemy you were born to destroy and win a new future for our children. I choose to fight. Who will join me? I don't want to regret curing the genophage. Do you want this or not? I do. What about the rest of you? <laughs> for the genophage, Rex. You'll have to placate them somehow. I'll demand the Council return some of our old territory. We'll need room to expand. Recapture the glory of the Ancients. Glory of Ancients led to Krogan rebellions, countless deaths, creation of genophage, expansion plan, problematic. What were the ancient Krogan like? Tachanka wasn't always a wasteland. In the old times, the Krogan were a proud people. We had dreams, a future to look forward to. Until Solarian interference? No, we destroyed Tachunga ourselves. Technology changed us. It made life too easy. So we looked for new challenges, 
and found them in each other. Nuclear war was inevitable. And now our planet is rubble. We'll need a better place to live. Any hint of the Krogan trying to expand again could raise alarms. My children aren't going to suffocate in this cesspool. I want them to witness a new age. A Krogan Empire. Rex. I'm not saying we won't ask first, but the Council can't expect us to stay here forever. There's that look in your eye again, Commander. What's troubling you? Just thinking about Earth. Your courage for my people will be remembered. You won't be alone in your fight. Why are we stopping? Morden, stay with Eve. It's looking ugly out here. Will do. Look at that reaper. It's the end of the world out there. The sky like that. can't make it through. Turian Wing Artemek, this is Shepard. We've been delayed. Hold off your attack. Negative, Commander. Our approach is locked. The Reaper are over here. An airstrike alone won't do it. We have to get in that fight. Is everyone okay? Yeah, just scratches. Nothing the Solarian can't patch up. Reeves truck made it out too. What was that? The Turians had to call off the airstrike. We'll need a new plan for dealing with the Reaper. First we'll have to find you. Where did you end up? Underground. We see ruins of some kind. Commander, that's the city of the ancients. How do we get out? No maps exist. It's been abandoned for thousands of years. You're a trailblazer, Shepard. Get through there and we'll find a place to meet up. Nothing will stop this cure. There it is again. That didn't feel like a tremor to me. Rex, are you guys feeling these tremors? Not up here. It could be something else, Commander. It is said that Kalros, the mother of all Thresher Maws, lives in this region. Which is another reason to get your ass out of there, Shepard. Step on it. Did I hear that right? Kalros, the mother of all Thresher Maws? When the Krogan name a Thresher Maw, you know you're in trouble. 
They don't think anyone's ever going to kill it. Wild Guess says that's Cal Ross. If that's what we've been hearing down here, I suggest we get moving. Outside. Well, if you can see sunlight, that's progress. And the color green. I thought plants were extinct around here. You're looking at hope. All that's left of it on Tachanka. This is once a world full of beauty. Given a chance, it can be again. Shepard, that Reaper is still up to no good at the Shroud. Find a way out of there and we'll pick you up. We're on it. Dealing with the Reaper when we get there will be another matter. I never knew the Krogan had this in them. Maybe Eve is right. Curing the genophage might lead to a Krogan renaissance. Ahead, we've got seeing all this, don't we?
now. Rex, you're right about Cal Ross. She's on the move. Now we've got some ideas on that. What? Not now, Rex. The commander has enough to worry about. What's happening? Some crazy idea we can talk about later. Just worry about getting out of there right now. right now. One giant death trap. And the thing is, I bet. I wonder where we are now. Maybe some kind of memorial. Watch it, more ahead. I see them. No way he survived that. But he was a pain in the ass anyway. Now let's finish this. There's a Reaper waiting for us.
We don't have a plan for this. I know we've beaten the odds before. But getting to that town... I don't know. We're curing the genophage no matter what it takes. Everything my people will ever be depends on it. And I hope this idea you were talking about is a good one. It was hers, actually. Kalros. We summon her to the Reaper. Would that even work? Already discussed strategy. Just need to distract Reaper. Draw it from power while cure synthesized. Released. What makes you so sure she'll come? Legends say she is the mother from which all other Thresher Maws spawn. This is as much her home as ours. If Tuchanka has a temper, Galros is it. Nobody's ever faced her and survived. We flew through the Omega-4 relay and survived. We can do this. That's the spirit, Shepard. How would we summon her? The tower was built in an arena devoted to Kalros's glory. The Salarians thought she would scare away intruders. Appears to have worked. There are two Maw Hammers there, the largest in existence. If you can activate them, Kalros will come. That should distract the Reaper. Meanwhile, laboratory nearby. We'll finish synthesizing cure. We know why we're here and what's at stake. So let's make it happen. Wait! I want you to know that no matter what happens, you've been a champion to the Krogan people, a friend of Clan Erdnot, and a sister to me. To every Krogan born after this day, the name Shepard will mean hero! Now, let's show them why! Go! I've got this! I have heard that Rex, and this is my planet! See you on the other side. Stay alive, Shepard. We'll have cure ready. Let's get in there! Go! 
Let's push ahead. Over on our left, one of the hammers. Morton, is the cure ready? Yes. Loaded for dispersal in two minutes. Procedure traumatic for Eve, but not lethal. Malin's research invaluable. She's okay? Headed to safety now. Her survival fortunate. We'll stabilize new government should Rex get any ideas. Good match. Promising future for Krogan. Damn! Control room at top of Shroud Tower. Must take elevator up. You're going up there? Yes. Readings at lab suggest temperature malfunction. Could affect cure viability. Need to adjust settings manually. It's not a malfunction. It's sabotage. Your people did it years ago. Of course. Shroud necessary for distribution. STG would have backup plan. Contingency to stop cure. And you knew. I'm not sure I can trust the Krogan. But I trust you. Thank you, Shepard. Difficult decision. Why it had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong.
A long time ago, my father betrayed me in this place, his own son. He tried to kill me, so I had to kill him, right over there. That's what the genophage reduced us to, animals. But you changed that today, Shepard. Now we'll fight for our children, not against them. It's just a pity Morden had to die. told me he had to do it. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. He got it right for everyone. A thousand years from now, we'll probably be singing songs about him. <laughs> I'm sure he'd like that. But you, Commander, we can thank you in person. Tell the Turians I'll be deploying troops to Palavan immediately. And when you're ready to kick the Reapers off Earth, you let me know. The Krogan are back in business. Goodbye, Commander. What will you do now? Spread the hope you've given us. Even now, there are clans gathering in the Kelphic Valley. I'll go speak to them and make sure this gift isn't squandered. Thank you for all that you've done. And know that Erdnot Bakara calls you a friend. Hell of a thing you just pulled off, Commander. Curing the Genophage? I never thought I'd see the day. Rex has agreed to help the Turians, Admiral. We should get their full support. I take it that leaves the Solarians out of the equation. The cost of their support was too high, sir. Well, I'll defer to your judgment on that, Commander. Let's hope we don't need them. Pack it out. Commander, Erdnot Rax has begun sending troops to Palavan. You kept your end of the bargain, and now I'll keep mine. The Turian hierarchy will stand with humanity against the Reapers. We're going to need you. Don't forget where we live. Never. It's clear we all fight together, or die. To that end, several dry dock ships are ready to help build the Crucible. Garrus will coordinate them. Yes, sir. And when the time comes to deploy it, the full measure of our fleet will be there for Earth. May the spirits watch over us all. I'll start managing Turian support right away, Shepard. You must be exhausted. Morden dying... it can't be easy. I'll sleep when I'm dead. We both know you need a clear head to win a war. There's no room for mistakes here. You should catch some shut-eye. I'll make sure Joker doesn't launch any suicide missions. Anything happens, you let me know.
Screw that. I can hold them off. Go back and get a Lenko. Screw that. I can hold them off. So go back and get a link. You know it's the right choice, LT. It's open. Shepard, there's something you need to hear. All right. Is this a bad time? Thinking of some friends who aren't around thanks to this war. That's thanks to the Reapers, not you. Are you thinking about anyone in particular? Ashley back on Vermeer. She gave her life stopping Sovereign. I wonder what she'd make of fighting a whole fleet of Reapers. If I had to guess, Ashley would call it target practice. Yeah. Sounds like her. Didn't you have something for me? The Solarian Counselor has an urgent matter. Let me guess. She called the comm room. The Council must be taking the Crucible seriously. I'll see you downstairs. Commander. Can I help you, Counselor? Shepard, I want you to understand that I owe my position to you, and it's not something that I take lightly. Were it not for you, that weak-minded Counselor Valorn would still be alive, leading the Solarians down the sewage pipe. But now I'm forced to champion a cure for the genophage. It's like saying we need a hurricane to put out a wildfire. It's not a wildfire, it's the death of the galaxy. Drum that into your people's heads. They'll follow you. A short-term solution, but the short-term may be all we have. Has a ring to it. But that is not the only reason I contacted you. The other regards humanity's counselor, Udina. We need to talk about his activities. The less than legal ones. Come see me next time you're on the Citadel. Ishil out. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCom. Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? Do you know how the other races are doing against the Reapers? Believe it or not, the Turians and Krogan actually seem to be getting along. Or not Rex has deployed troops, and they're giving the Reapers a moment of pause. The Solarians are still hanging on to Sirkesh, but the Reapers are starting to breathe down their necks, too. What about the Asari? They have to be feeling the heat. The Reapers are moving fast with the obvious intent of taking Thessia. Interestingly, the Reapers are leaving Parnak alone. It's the Yogg homeworld. Can't say that I blame them. Yogg have teeth. Well, if we lose this war, it might be them running the next cycle. It's easy to forget the Reapers don't destroy every species. Just the ones who can threaten them. Any word on the Volus and Elcor? The Turians and the Krogan sent forces to the Volus homeworld, Evroom. It might not be enough, but at least they've got Reaper forces bogged down in a nasty ground war. 
As for Elcor, they're still in the fight, though our projections show the Reapers encroaching on their territory soon. What happened to the Batarians? Never stood a chance, hit by the Reapers straight out of the gate. And without any allies to call on, I think the Batarians are history. Have we heard anything from the Quarians or Geth? Something might be brewing near the Geth border, but our intel is sketchy. News is getting harder to come by as things get worse. What's our state of readiness, Admiral? I won't lie, Shepard. We're bogged down. Things aren't looking good in most sectors. We need to increase the tempo and chalk up some winds, otherwise... This won't end well for the human race. Or any race. What about the extra help we picked up along the way? The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Erdnot Rex running the show is a bonus for us. And that female Krogan you rescued is rallying more support from the other clans. I'm glad you disabled that mom and Tachanka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support as it is. We picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. What about Arya's mercenaries? Arya Talok, there's someone I never thought we'd be in bed with. The blood pack will be useful, and violent. Mostly Vorchai I hear. We'll put the Blue Suns to good use. Intel says Narnir Vosk is bringing his men, and that they're gunning for a fight. The Eclipse are providing troops and mechs. When we find a Reaper soft spot, they'll help us hit it. Don't want to know how you got Arya's cooperation, but whatever you did, it was worth it. How about the Solarians? Interesting wrinkle. We've been getting back channel commitments from the strike teams within STG. They're promising to back us. Even after I cured the genophage? Our intel suggests there are cracks developing between the military and the politicians. These STG guys know the score. They're not gonna jeopardize the entire Solarium Union just because some Delatras didn't get her way. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Commander, Admiral Hackett has requested your help with a Cerberus fighter base on Navaria.
Wish you could have seen that gun on Tachanka firsthand. I cut the auditory emulators and watched that Cerberus cruiser gracefully and silently disintegrate. Beautiful. Sometimes I worry about you, man. Just one more diagnostic suite. You think that cure they dispersed could do anything to us? We're not gonna start growing scales or anything, right? Maybe now that we have the Krogan on board, we can go back to fighting the Reapers. I was looking at the specs on that Reaper you took out on Tachanka. That was one of the small ones? Don't get me wrong, it's still dead, but damn. There was nothing small about it. Hey. Settling in, Javik? I believe some of the crew wishes to be my friend. That is not my purpose here. Also, I find I need to wash my hands. The residue of this ship is strong. How so? I have been exploring. There are traces of those who lived on the Normandy before. I detected a human female. Her genetic structure was unnatural, as if artificially created. Sounds like Miranda. And a drill. There was illness in him. Thane. And the Krogan we met, who lived in these quarters, he was undergoing a metamorphosis. His memories were confused, not organic to his mind. There was great confusion and turmoil. I still can't wrap my head around that, reading information like you do. For my people, it was as natural as breathing. Evolution's an amazing force. Our scientists believed it was the only force in the galaxy that mattered. They called it the Cosmic Imperative. The strong flourished, the weak perished. The governments of your cycle seem concerned with ensuring the survival of all. Was this imperative just your scientists' opinion, or did they prove something we don't know? The universe had already proven it. They only had to look around. And saw what, exactly? Extinction is the rule of law in the cosmos. The natural order of things. The weakest species are doomed. We can't afford any weak links in this war. They drain our resources. They can become a resource of their own. How? If the Reapers are busy conquering the weak, they are not watching you. So use them as a distraction. All strategies must be considered, and few are too extreme. Though I do not think your Asari approves of my beliefs. Liara? I think she just had a different idea about what Protheans were like. We are all a product of our time. Had I been born in this cycle, perhaps I would be the noble scholar she wishes me to be. Maybe. Or maybe you'd still be a soldier. I do wonder sometimes. Living a life of constant war, taking life in every battle. Does it get to you? It shapes me. A stone is shaped by the one who carves it. This stone has no choice in the form it will take. You and I, Commander. War is our sculptor. And we are prisoners to its design. Maybe not much longer. We win this and we'll both be set free. You have killed a Reaper. I would like to have seen it. No matter. There will be more. Plenty more. Yes. A difficult fight remains. In your position, I would have offered the Salarian leader a deal. Oh? You only had to make the Krogan believe you cured their disease. They are too stupid to know the difference. The Salarians would have been grateful and rewarded you. Both would have served you at the same time. Morality and friendship do not matter now. Your allies are simply resources to use against the Reapers. If 
the Krogan seek retribution for the past. Do not waste time on sterility plagues. Destroy them where they stand. In the meantime, they are useful cannon fodder against the Reapers. Do not care what others think. Do what you must. Do not care what others think. Do what you must. So I hear the elusive man drinks bourbon. It all makes sense now. What do you mean? You love whiskey? Hey, Scotch, my dear girl. That scunner drinks American bourbon. Completely different. He's a psychotic megalomaniac, and you've got problems with his choice of liquor? You've obviously never experienced the peat aroma of a fine Eli Scotch. Shepard. My board is green. Commander. Jennifer is here, huh? This beats the hell out of reporting on the Milgram City Council. I don't think I've heard of Milgram. Which place is that again? Beckenstein. It's right next door to the Citadel. I'm a colony kid. Commander, got a minute? What do you want to know? You've just implemented a cure for the genophage. Millions of Krogan will start fighting the Reapers. What do you say to people who think humanity is starting another Rachni war and Krogan rebellions? We all know our history, but this isn't 1400 years ago. But if the genophage is gone, what makes these Krogan different from the ones that rebelled? The Krogan have no warships. If the Reapers focus on them, they could be wiped out. Combining their infantry with the Turian fleet is a huge asset, and both parties know it. Are you aware that Clan Erdnot is already petitioning the Council for an embassy and rights to a colony world? The Krogan are coming to the aid of a Council homeworld. That's more than a lot of species can say. I helped them get the genophage cure. Anything more is between the Council and the Krogan. There it is, straight from Commander Shepard. Until tomorrow, this is Diana Allers. Good night and stay strong. Okay, I'll cut that together with the rest of the segment and send it to command for approval. Commander. Any sign of life? The Reaper destroyed by the Thresher Maw appears to be completely inert, Doctor. We would need to send in teams to be sure. Out of the question. Tell the Krogan to stay away. The genophage cured. The Krogan have no reason to hold back now, do they? Rex knows what he's doing, but can he keep the Krogan in check? Or will this be the start of another Krogan Empire? Eve's organizing the female Krogan. She reminds me of some of the more formidable matriarchs I've known. The Krogan won't let themselves fall by the wayside again. Greetings, Not like they did after the rebellions. We'll have to get used to them having a bigger part in the galaxy. I hope the Krogan live up to their ancient legacy, and for the better. Hello, Commander. Hello. Hello, Commander.
What are you up to now? I am uploading data on the destroyed Reaper to the Turians. They are investigating possible Reaper structural weakness. Our data says Reaper capital ships such as Sovereign are of unique design. However, smaller Reaper destroyers bear similarities. That one was small? Relatively, yes. Ground attack ships are only 160 meters in height. Sovereign was approximately two kilometers. Well, keep talking to the Turians. If there's a chink in the Reaper's armor, we all need to know it. Hello, Shepard. The Turians have given us top-level access to their combat data. Their ships are already moving in to help the Alliance fleet. You actually secured a Krogan Turian alliance. It's one thing to hear about Commander Shepard. It's another to see her in action. Commander? All right, my turn. What's the first order an Alliance commander gives at the start of combat? Uh, I give up. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> All right, big guy. What do you call it when a Turian gets killed by a horrible spiky monster? A friendly fire. Come on, that one goes back to Shang-Chi. How you gotta respect the classics? How many humans does it take to activate a dormant mass relay? 602. 600 to vote on it, one to ask the Asari for technical help, and one to request a seat on the council afterward. How do you know when a Turian's out of ammo? He switches to the stick up his ass as a backup weapon. Why does the Alliance hire pilots with brittle bone disease? You're, you're shitting me! The Turian military has one about me? Oh, absolutely. I heard it myself from a private back on Palavin. All right, why does the Alliance hire pilots with brittle bone disease? So their Marines can beat someone in hand-to-hand -hand drills. <laughs> Damn, you need to tell James that one. Hey, what's the hardest part about treating a Turian who took a rocket to one side of his face? Figuring out which side took the rocket. <sighs> Never thought I'd see the Krogan and the Turians team up. Even the Reapers have to be a little nervous about pissing them off. I'd say more than a little. I'm sorry about Morden. If not for him, we wouldn't have the Krogan Alliance. He'll have a hell of a tombstone, cured the genophage, with a little asterisk, and then at the bottom it'll say, which he also created. I always thought he was crazy. Useful, but crazy. Then he gives up his own life. <laughs> to save the Krogan. Doesn't do much to disprove the crazy theory, huh? <laughs> I guess not. But he was one of ours. So now that we got the Krogan and the Turians, what now? The Krogan help us turn the tide on Palavin. They can shoot at something useful for a change. Dig till we hit daylight, huh? Works for me. So how does it feel knowing Krogan will be singing songs about you until the end of time? I think it would be an honor. There's enough misery in this universe. It's nice to see something go right for a change. Can't say I've ever really witnessed history in the making like this. Well, except for Sovereign attacking the Citadel, and then there was the Collector base, but this one felt good. And let's hope Rex keeps running the show on Tachanka. Maybe we should hire a food taster for him. Imagine the carnage if someone like that brother of his Reeve took over. It could happen. I know, it's a chance we have to take, but I have to say, if it wasn't my own world that needed the help, I might have looked for a way out. I'd be lying if I said I didn't consider it. Anyone would have second thoughts about the Krogan. They just better remember you didn't act on it and return the favor.
strategic advantage in this sector thanks to the fighter squadron facility you're about to attack. We want to seize it, but their air defenses are too strong for a frontal assault. Losses would be too cost prohibitive. How do you want me to handle this? Go in the back, bring down their defenses so we can send in the troops. Good luck, Commander. I have visual contact. There's a small platform above the main landing pad. I can drop you there, but it's gotta be now. Let's do it. center. Get out of there. Come on! 
Cortez, I read you. Come in. Give it everything you got. Got it. Anyone wounded? That shouldn't matter. Copy that, Lieutenant. This was a major victory, Commander. A crippling blow to Cerberus operations in this sector. Now all we have to do is maintain control of the facility. Cerberus won't make that easy. And we won't make it easy on them. Thanks to you, we can use their own defenses against them. Tell your team they did good, Commander. You should be proud. Thank you, sir. That's all. Hack it out. more sympathetic to someone joining Cerberus. You've never been big on aliens. Yeah, I enlisted to kick ass, just like everyone else. And I need a better reason than it has scales to go kill somebody. And if Cerberus is taking our dishonorable discharges and Cat-6 washouts, it's just one more reason they're not worth a damn. You've got new messages, Commander. Your Joker pilot insists I call myself Prothe the Prothean. I insisted he allow me to throw him out the airlock. Seeing all these primitives flying spaceships is unexpected and very dangerous. Commander. Gabi, have you ever seen recordings of Liara's mother? Matriarch Venezia? Yes. What about her? And remember Samara, the Asari Justica? Where are you going with this, Kenneth? Have you noticed that older Asari women seem to be a bit more ample? Do you think they just keep growing? Kenneth! 
I think I'll spend my sunset days in an Asari retirement home. If I don't kill you first. Nothing to report. Commander. Commander. Breaking now, the Arcturus station destroyed, and the Alliance Parliament feared dead. But Admiral Stephen Hackett says the fleets can regroup. We'll hear it from him right here in the battle space. Huh. Second Star Broadcasting is headhunting me. I liked their Garvuk story, but seriously, I'm on the Normandy. Do we need to talk, Commander? Not right now, Allers. Let me know when we do. your service. Thanks for coming by. Another time. something to shoot right now. Commander? How's the ship running, Edie? I am updating the cyber warfare suite around our Reaper IFF. It should resemble Reaper code exactly. Hello, Shepard. something. Evasion successful.
Signal confirmed. Reapers eluded. light jump successful. Evasion successful. Reapers eluded. Faster than light jump successful. something. Reapers eluded. Signal confirmed. Faster than light jump successful. Evasion successful. I found something.
Alliance Control, this is SSV Normandy. Are we clear to descend? Alliance Control, this is Normandy. We're headed to Bay 1-4, Zakara Ward. Are we clear to descend? What the hell's going on down there? Even if there were a station malfunction, they'd have backups online. I got a bad feeling here. Checking emergency channels. Hey, yeah, this is Joker. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, no kidding. Commander, there's a communication from Thane. He says it's important. I think you'll want to hear this. Put him through. Shepard, the Citadel is under attack. Cerberus troops are everywhere and they're in control of the docks. Are you safe? No. I had to evade their commandos at the hospital. I'm in a Presidium storefront. Did Caden make it out? We got separated. He said he had to protect the Council. I'm going to CSEC headquarters. Why CSEC headquarters? It's been compromised, and CSEC's response depends on it. As long as Cerberus is holding the headquarters, they have the station. All right, Joker. Get us away from the docks and close to CSEC HQ. We'll deploy in the shuttle. Aye, aye, Commander.
Shepard, I saw those Cerberus troops on you. I thought you were done for. Bailey, what are you doing here? Getting my ass shot off trying to retake headquarters. Cerberus took it in the first push. We gotta kick them out of there. Everyone in C-Sec's flying blind without the network. What about the government? Have your leaders been killed? They split up. I'll know more if I can access the terminal inside. Can you get us in? I'll get the door. If no one interrupts me with a bullet this time. Here we go, CSET network access, courtesy of Cerberus. How's that gonna help? Cerberus has control of the main channels, but I can set up a new one. Without it, our people have no plan and no chance. Hello. What have you got? A warning from Counselor Ashiel. She's supposed to be here meeting with the Executor. This move may provoke retaliation. Well, that's an understatement. If she's inside, she's in trouble. Why would the Counselor be meeting with the Executor? Usually it means someone big's about to be prosecuted. I guess that someone had Cerberus friends. The Counselor would have a clearer picture for all the good that does us. The Counselor's in there surrounded by Cerberus? Who put together that security detail? Well, until an hour ago, this place was as safe as it got. Nobody expected something on this scale. We need to find the Counselor and get her out of here. She has got to know more about who's behind this. The Executor's office is defensible. She may have gone to ground there when the shooting started. I'm on it. Just a sec. There. Now we can talk by Omnitool. Go! It is done. Thank Did you hear all that? Yes. I'm nearing the building, but running is difficult. I'll try to get to you. in the lobby. They were dug in. I can see more through the cameras. They're all over the station. Commander, these bodies have entry wounds at the base of the skull. Given the position of the bodies, they were likely surprised by individuals they knew. Same as Mars. Cerberus likes their sleeper agents.
seems Cerberus was very thorough and methodical. None yet. Damn it. Keep looking. Are you all right? Your body language indicates contemplation. In my cycle, it is said the Reapers took this station in a matter of hours. To see its inhabitants fight back gives me pause. You are welcome to share your feelings. There is hope for those living now. There was none for my species. That is all. We've got to be close now. There is damage here. We may be too late.
Bailey, looks like they got the Executor and two Solarian bodyguards. Damn. All right, keep searching. If you don't see the Counselor's body, don't count her out yet. Found her. She looks unharmed. Get her somewhere safe. Don't even think about it. Shepard, he's going to kill us all. That remains to be seen. I mean Udina. He's staging a coup. The other counselors are headed for a trap. Three on one, pal. It's over. No. No, it's fun. How bad is it? I have time. Catch him. Shepard, what's going on up there? Thane needs medical help fast, and I need to take care of an assassin. He must be going after the rest of the Council. Get the word out. Udina's trying to seize power. I've got to get to the Counselors. They're being taken to a shuttle pad on the Presidium. Start driving. I'll try to raise them on the comm. Good work, Bailey. We're almost there. I'm on foot now. Any luck contacting the Council?
We've got to be close now. There is damage here. We may be too late. Looks like they got the Executor and two Solarian bodyguards. Damn. All right, keep searching. If you don't see the Counselor's body, don't count her out yet. Found her. She looks unharmed. Get her somewhere safe. Take care of an assassin. He must be going after the rest of the council. Get the word out. Udina's trying to seize power. I've got to get to the counselors. They're being taken to a shuttle pad on the Presidium. Start driving. I'll try to raise them on the comm. I've got a fix on the council's position. I'm sending it to your car. Good work, Bailey. We're almost there. <laughs> Any luck contacting the Council? Negative. Their guards are dead. But we've still got vital signs on the Council's transponders. Where are they going? The shuttle pad above Shalmar Plaza. Dean is with them. If he can get them in range of that assassin, this is all over. On my way. Yes, Commander!
did not use a restraining harness for me. Commander Jones. Placing sludge on my head will not cure a concussion. Now let's fight! Traitors have sealed the door. Delmar Plaza. Where's the council? In an elevator. They're trying to get to the shuttle dock. Someone's following them. Someone with a sword. Great. I'm in the shack. Hang on, this will be a fast climb. Tell me that assassin hasn't reached the council. He's trying, but I'm making his elevator stop on every floor. Nice. I found our friend. Kill his elevator. There's a power conduit beneath it. Acknowledge. Shepard, bad news. Is there any other kind? That hitman jumped to another elevator and he 
he's overridden my controls. He's on his way up. I can't stop him. I'll handle it. Ababa! It's blocking our escape. She's with Cerberus. Put away the weapon. You don't want this to get ugly. Trust me. That bastard has it coming. Yeah, that bastard is one of the last human leaders in Citadel space, Commander. Shepard admitted to working with Cerberus. For all we know, she's still with him. He's got a point, Shepard. There are Cerberus soldiers in the elevator shaft behind us. If you open that door, they'll kill you all. What Shepard says is possible. Unlikely, but possible. We don't have time to debate this. We're dead if we stay out here. I'm overriding the lock. Shepard, look at us. <sighs> this can't end well. Just put it down. Ball's in your court. Open that door and the Council's dead. I might regret gunning you down for the rest of my life, but I will do it. Udina, step away from the Council. To hell with this! He's got a gun! Council back and cover that door. The door. Bailey. Made it as fast as we could, Shepard. Looks like you uh, took care of things. Then it's true. We were in danger. But I don't understand. You said Cerberus was right here. Cerberus was right here, but they beat feet into the Keeper Tunnels when they figured out we were coming. Sorry, Counselor, I'll say it plain. Shepard just saved the lot of you. And I owe you, Shepard, for our lives and for brokering a deal with the Primarch of the Krogan that I never could. Too bad it took this to get you on board. We will not make that same mistake again. Shepard, do you have any idea why Cerberus would do this? Honestly, no. But I plan to find out. All right, people. Principals are evacuated. We got a tunnel and a million more places to secure. Move it. Yes? Things didn't go as planned. The Council's still in control of the Citadel, and Udina's dead. Udina was expendable. Now what? There are other plans in motion. I'll fill you in when you return. I'm surprised you let Shepard get the better of you, Ling. It won't happen again. Hmm. We'll see. We looked over every centimeter of those tunnels, Shepard. Your Cerberus pal is made out of smoke and mirrors. What, these are tunnels, right? Just one exit and one entrance. No, that keeper tunnel from the elevator lobby led into the superstructure. Once you're in there, the place is like an ant farm. 
We can't even get an ID on him. He released a VI into the Citadel system that erased footage of him wherever he went. I guess he didn't trust that Adina's plan would come together. That reminds me, we got your friend Thane into work to Memorial. He's in for surgery. Apparently, uh, there's complications. Do you think he'll make it? I caught that they didn't have much drill blood on the Citadel. I notified his next of kin, his son Koliat. He was the right blood type, but I don't know if he made it in time. We're pretty sure the route to the hospital is safe from Cerberus. If you want to see him, uh, I'd go now. I'll get on it. Oh, and you can tell him the Salarian Counselor says he's a hero. It just, uh, I don't know, make things easier for him? This is a problem, boss. Cerberus has changed their ciphers, and our code breakers aren't getting anywhere at the moment. I've got our best teams working in shifts on it. But ensuring Citadel systems integrity is just going to take time. My wife was just sent back to active duty, and I'm about to get shipped out, too. I was told you might be able to help me. Of course. You're a Neosha spouse, correct? I... Yes! How did you know that? We keep identity information on all permanent Citadel residents engaged in formal relationships with Asari. That way, should anyone require diplomatic aid, we can ensure prompt assistance. That's wonderful! Then you can help me send my daughter back to my wife's family? I... I'm afraid, however, that might be a bit difficult. They hit where? Damn it. How are we supposed to predict the moves of an enemy we don't understand? Divert to... Crap, do we have any AI-enabled fragments of Sovereign? Any Reaper code I can analyze? No? Well, then they'll keep outmaneuvering our ships. I think I recovered the obelisk you mentioned from the Shrike Abyssal. It's waiting in bay D24. Really? Thank you, Earth Clan. Were your people involved in a secret construction project of some sort? I am certain this obelisk would help. We don't have enough volunteers. If we could get the rings of a loon from the Salian Nebula, 
We could declare a cultural crisis. People would have to listen. No, they're not just symbolic. The Asari were there. Welcome back to Huerta Memorial Hospital, Commander Shepard. How may I help you? Thank you. Please speak with me. Welcome to Serta. Be safe. generals. He was stabbed with a poison blade by a Cerberus soldier during the attack on the Citadel. We can't identify the toxin. We're barely getting him alive right now. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? Look at our stars, we help our Can I help you? I'm looking for a Drell named Thane Krios. Well, we have a Drell, but not under that name. He was injured. Stab wound. He's a regular patient here. It's all right. It's all right. I see. The doctors were able to repair a lot of the trauma. However, Mr. Hmm. Krios is in the final stages of Keprel's syndrome. At its worst, Keprel's syndrome interferes with his blood's ability to carry oxygen. And he lost a lot. Now, they've given him transfusions, but frankly, there was a very limited supply of Drell blood on the Citadel. I'll get more. Give me his blood type. That's not going to work. Only one other Drell on the station is a match, and that Drell is in with him now. We did all we could to help him through surgery, but his body can't replace lost blood with new cells. Too much shock. His son, Koliat, he's in there saying his goodbyes. You might want to say yours. Commander Shepard, my father mentioned you were no longer incarcerated. I don't know if you remember me, I'm Koliak Krios. I came to donate blood and, well, he asked me to take off his oxygen mask so he could be comfortable. I don't think it will be very long. Did he tell you he was sick? Yes. Back when I was, when I had my problems with the law. Knowing doesn't make it much easier. But at least, here, he'll want to see you. Commander, <clears throat> I'm afraid I won't be joining you again. Never known you to be afraid, Thane. Not a great time to start. <laughs> I fear, just not mortal ones. <laughs> There's something I must do before it gets worse. I must... <coughs> Alahira, mistress of inscrutable depths, I ask forgiveness. Kalahira, whose waves wear down stone and sand. Wash the sins from this one, and set him on the distant shore of the infinite spirit. Goliad, you speak as the priests do. You have been spending time with them. I brought a prayer book. Commander, would you care to join me? Kalahira, this one's heart is pure, but beset by wickedness and contention. Guide this one to where the traveler never tires, the lover never leaves, the hungry never starve. 
guide this one, Kalahira. And she will be a companion to you as she was to me. who lives or dies. That's not what we do. We help our patients, all of them. That's a nice sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. I've seen this happen in combat before. And we will run out of supplies. Have you seen the projections the administration center made? I have. The situation is going to get worse. What's your point? We can't deny the facts. If we prioritize them, some of our patients are in a much better position to survive. If we take care of them first and ration our supplies, we can save some now and enable ourselves to save more later. We cannot do that. We swore no- Everyone makes sacrifices in wartime. You'll make yours sooner or later. I'm sure I will. But I'll do it without betraying my oath or my patience. It's not that simple. If we aren't careful about this now, we'll end up losing everyone. Then we'll find a way. Look, we have more of the And CSAC forces have killed the last invading forces. shuttle. Afternoon and then night and I'm hiding from husks and those Turian things. The file says the evacuation team thought your position was overrun. So after two days, I still don't know. Spectre status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Presidium Commons. Listen, I thought of something. No, it can't wait until I'm back on duty. The Hesperia period. Their statues had legendarily accurate Prothean inscriptions. Can we use that? Yes, I know the Athena Nebula is off limits, but this... a classified project. It needs all the Prothean intel we can find. I recovered the Book of Plenix. It's waiting for you in Bay D24. Earth Clan, this is a priceless gift. Thank you. You may help my people remember themselves. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. Any opened goods can only be returned for store credit. Please visit any of our Elkos Combine affiliate branches for any and all. Welcome to Kanala Exports. At Kanala Exports, we believe that a peaceful heart is a strong heart. Kanala we Exports is pleased to offer goods for security and peace of mind. Doctors are working to keep that terrorist bastard alive. 
He's in intensive care? He got blasted by Cerberus. They think he's just another victim. If he's a terrorist, he ought to be locked up. He should be shot. Gorex wanted for six bombings. Six. Killed both humans and Batarians. He bombed his own people? Why? He was part of a terror cell. Picked crowded places. Voya, Omega. Doesn't matter to these asshole fanatics who gets blown up. No, the Krogan are the only race that can fight on the toxic world, so they need support. Well, ideally, something like a Cacliosaur. They're good in mountains, immune to toxins, ferociously loyal to their riders. Yes, they'd be ideal. Unfortunately, they were driven to extinction during the Rachni War. So, unless we can engineer something new, Krogan on toxic worlds will have to fight on foot without support. Cerberus trap? Bomb or turret? How many this time? Clear the area until you've done a full sweep. We need a way to find their tech and shut it off. These are control schematics for Cerberus turrets. Will these help? Damn right they will. I'll have E-Crimes dig into them. Might even help us find the little present Cerberus left for us. Thanks a lot. This is gonna save lives. I know the Hades Nexus is off limits. I'm not an idiot. Damn it, the Alliance needs that thing right now. The Obelisk of Karza was supposed to contain Prothean language translation. The scene contains large scorch marks. You want my security vids? Bring me a warrant. You're still warranty? I heard those vids could be vital to the war effort. I doubt the Reapers have agents doing business in my cafe. We're trying to protect you. Hell of a job you're doing. See those scorch marks? Cerberus killed one of my servers right there. Where were you? Hey, I lost friends too. If you care about finding the Cerberus informants who made it happen, you'll give me the bid. We're at war. If you care about the safety of the Citadel, you'll help CSEC however you can. Thank you. I have some high-profile customers. If word gets out that I'm ratting them out to CSEC, you think I care about insider trading or electronic smuggling right now? I'm after the bastards who attacked the city. Nobody else. You got my nose. All right. Just... I hope it helps. No replacement has been selected for the position vacated by Council. to everyone in the Citadel. C-Sec will shut this whole place down. C-Sec couldn't protect us when Cerberus attacked. I'll take him to court. You think a court is going to want more people running with guns right now? Then I'll go to the wards and sell them the back room at Purgatory. 
People are already scared. If you violate weapons laws, they'll just be scared and trigger happy. We're at war. If the Citadel gets attacked again, everybody needs to fight. The commander's right. It's not like those Reaper things care about hurting civilians. But selling weapons to just anyone makes it easier for groups like Cerberus to get a hold of them. Cerberus attacked the Citadel with military-grade weapons and powered armor. I doubt they need one of my pistols. Okay, you're right. Just... just be careful. Welcome to Agor Munitions. Our customer service specialists are always interested in purchasing new technology. Remember, all purchases may welcome to Cypertine Armory. Professional grade equipment at reasonable prices. That's Cypertine. All Citratine Armory products include a lifetime guarantee for performance. See our extranet site for details. Proceeds from all sales go to help the troops on Palavan. All Citratine Armory products include a lifetime guarantee for performance. See our extranet site for details. Hello, Shepard. Nice to see you. refugees have been through. Can't you let me in? No. I only need a couple of hours of footage. You're not crossing that dock. Wait, aren't you Commander Shepard? Solik Vaz, documentary maker. Please, maybe you can help. I'm trying to document the stories of the refugees coming to the Citadel. Their loss, their sacrifices, their moments of bravery. Something holding you back? CSEC won't allow me on the docks. They say I'd be disruptive. But you could catch a few quick shots for me. There are lots of refugees on the rest of the Citadel. It won't have the same impact as seeing crowds trapped on the docks. We all need to help each other. I want this documentary to shock people into action. Good idea. The galaxy should see what these refugees have been through. Thank you, Commander. That's exactly what I'm hoping for. If you could just take a few shots with your Omni-Tool in the refugee camp. I'll be here when you're done. yours. No one can take that away. I love you, but I know you. Don't make me an anchor. Promise me, Steve. Goodbye, Robert. I'm glad you came. I just need a few moments to myself.
pressure's okay. No infection so far. Can I talk to him? Only if it's important, Commander. He's hurt bad. Take down the sedative a bit, but hurry. I peg his survival at 50-50. Are you Gorek? Go away. Nothing to say. Not even what a terrorist's doing on the Citadel? You! Do I know you? <coughs> Every Batarian with someone on Aratok remembers your face. The planet that got caught in the Alpha Relay explosion. You butcher a colony, only regret them. <laughs> Don't have the strength to... <sighs> I destroyed Eratot's really to stop the Reapers from pouring through. Ah. Easy for you to claim now that they're here. Don't pretend you have any remorse. No one here would even be alive if I hadn't destroyed that relay. I spent months taking heat for Eratot from both the Alliance and the Batarians, and you know what? If it saved the entire galaxy, I can live with that just fine. Then why don't you... <laughs> then why don't you get rid of another Batarian for your precious galaxy? <laughs> Shut down this machine. Just let me die. I'm done here. Good. He'll cough himself to death without a sedative. No! Wait! I... <sighs> Just take it easy. There. Welcome to Batarian State Arms. Batarian State Arms, defending the hegemony. Please observe all cast restrictions when making a purchase. Stand strong for your people with Batarian State Arms. Your purchases are a credit to the hegemony. What are you doing here? I'm waiting. Waiting? Waiting for who? Oh, for my parents. They put me on the rescue transport and said to wait for them here. They'll come find me as soon as they can. I guess this is a safe enough place. Look, if anyone bothers you, let me know. I'll take care of them, okay? Sure thing, sir. Thanks. Hey, Commander. James, enjoying yourself? Yeah, yeah. Try not to lose everything. Those clothes are alone. Have a little faith, Commander. I have a little. You just gonna stand there and watch? Nice. Listen, please, we just need more food. I can give you the location of some ruins. Prothean ruins on Gay Hinnom in the Hades Nexus. If you could get past the Reaper patrols, I'm sure you'd find something valuable. Yeah, I'll take That's that. That's got to be worth something. Please, my family is starving. Hey, I've assumed full control of Eclipse, and we're committed to moving forward with Ari. Looks like you've been in some fights lately. And still me in a combat menu. I'm gonna do some crazy damage myself. Son of a bitch.
Hello, Commander Shepard. Welcome to Docking Bay E-24. This level has been repurposed to accommodate the recent influx of civilians on the Citadel. Please ensure that you observe proper security protocols at all times while in this area. How many people are stranded here? Any personal information pertaining to residents of these facilities cannot be revealed without prior authorization. However, be assured that the facilities allocated by Citadel Council are more than adequate for current requirements. Adequate? Absolutely. Furthermore, relocations requests are being given top priority. The Citadel is dedicated to ensuring optimal solutions for all. Thanks, Avina. Please speak with me again if you require further assistance. Thank you, Commander. I'll start editing it right away. Thank you, Commander. I'll start editing it right away. Spectre status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. Assisted Commander Shepard in preventing service forces. From Look, I filled out all the forms for So many pieces to put back together since the Cerberus attack. We're reeling from the implications. Udina in league with Cerberus trying to murder the Council. These are dark days for all of us.
All that time you were working for Udina, did you ever suspect? Always rubbed me a little wrong. Still, that traitorous bastard upped me. Probably made me for an idiot. <laughs> I guess I proved him right. He's dead and you're still here, Bailey. <laughs> Thanks to you. If you hadn't shown up, Udina and Cerberus would be dancing on my grave. Thought you'd be in the hospital. If I'm breathing, I'm working. Probably the worst I've ever been hurt. Fitting, I guess, given the state of the galaxy. But if Cerberus thinks a few slugs is gonna keep me out of action, they've got another thing coming. You hear anything about your family out there? Not a peep. I always believed I'd get a chance to tell my ex-wife a few things. And my kids on Earth. I was supposed to visit them. First vacation in years, but I had to cancel when I got promoted. Don't give up hope, Bailey. Thanks, Shepard. I'm really trying not to think about it. Can this station be defended? The internal security breaches have been patched, but we're dangerously low on manpower. We're grilling our own people and trying to figure out if Udina acted alone, but it's time-consuming. All in all, we're still vulnerable, but I think we've taken the right steps. How does the Citadel fit into the war now? Uh, the war finally found us. This is so far beyond our imagination, and we have been trained to expect the unexpected. Since the coup attempt, folks are shutting down and shutting in. I hear a lot of praying. And crying. They're saying this is the war to end all wars. Well, I haven't seen anything to say they aren't right. No time for rest. Good luck, Bailey. Yeah, you too, Shepard. Equipment. Send me a set of Vortex armor. Man, summoning and supply sure messed that one up. Oh, I've heard those are pretty good. It's great. I'd only be safer inside a tank. It's why Vortex gear costs more than I make in a year. can't keep us apart. The Blue Suns, Blood Pack, and Eclipse are in my pocket. I'll send them to war when you're ready for them. Is there anything on your mind? How's the rebuilding going? People understand the first order of business is shoring up defenses. No one wants another invasion. So they're enduring valiantly, not that they have a choice. Once again, 
I am Omega. We'll talk later. I'm sure. Ugh. This sucks. What have you got there? Duty roster for the students. It's what I do for fun now. They're dropping us into hot spots for hit and runs. I'm making sure your bosses don't get my kids killed. How are they holding up? They are fine. They're not the ones reading duty rosters while on shore leave. I know it's not fun, but you're doing good work. And it sounds like your students are helping. Damn right they're helping. Hell, we even saw some action on Palavin. They broke a line of those Batarian things. I think Prangley punted one into orbit. <laughs> even Rodriguez kept her shit together. Glad to hear it. Also help the Turians get a few thousand civilians out safely. It'd be a hell of a lot more fun with you. You find bigger fights. But the little shits are useless without me. I gotta stick with them. Cause I'm dependable now, apparently. I blame you for this, Shepard. Come on. What? The duty rosters can wait. Right now you're on shore leave. Shepard, everybody knows you can't dance. I miss afterlife. Yeah, this place is so clean and squeaks. Anyhow, thanks for the drink. But why'd you drag me out here? You, uh, still got that much of freedom. Yeah. Looking for work. Might as well. What you got? I'm curious. What material is your face made from? The surface is a flexible biomimetic nanomaterial over a metallic skull. The skin uses sheer thickening technology to help protect the central processing unit in the head. If the skin is struck or shot, it solidifies to absorb the impact. It also is capable of limited self-healing. And what about the hair? It is of similar construction. For defense, I have set it to cohere into a solid piece. However, for infiltration purposes, it can be parted into individual strands. If it has recently been exposed to water, I generally can't do a thing with it. attack on the Citadel to get folks around here to pay attention to the war. How's this any different from normal? Can't you see the desperation? This isn't happy dancing. This is forget my problems dancing. Look at the arms. If a guy waves his arms like that, he's worrying about a lot more than looking stupid on the dance floor. That's surprisingly observant. I've had time to watch a lot of dancing from the sidelines. Speaking of which... Dancing? Watching from the sidelines. What do you think about me and Edie? You know, with all this interest in Edie, it's possible you've overlooked other options. Uh... I, I never really considered it, Commander. No offense. Forget it. So, you and Edie. Well, yeah. What do you think? Why not? Because I could break a bone just from some light over-the-clothes action? It's always a risk, but then so are the Reapers. Yeah, I wasn't planning on dating Harbinger. You know what I mean. If we all ended up dead this time tomorrow, what would you regret? 
Getting a shattered pelvis. And a broken heart. Such a stupid idea. If you could be out there right now on the dance floor, would you be waving your arms? Yeah. Sounds like you got bigger things to worry about than looking stupid. Yeah, guess I do. Now, if you'll excuse me... Private. Let's fill you in before the squad arrives. The Alliance is posting us to an Ezo mining facility on Zani. It's a low gravity planet, toxic atmosphere. You'll be expected to maintain full survival gear. Any questions? Are we playing security, Sergeant OMB? No, Private. We are not.
replacement has been selected for the position vacated by Councillor Danelle Udina. Died assisting Cerberus in an attempted coup. Ma'am, I had a friend in security at Sonax, and there was definitely Prothean tech on Garbug. I know the Valhalla threshold is Reaper territory now, but Prothean tech could help the cruci... Caden, hey, I wondered where you went. What's up? I'm trying to wrap my head around what just happened. You sound angry. No, just not used to staring down the gun of someone I've worked with so closely. How it all went down, it's got me... I don't know. Okay, talk to me. Let's have it. If I hadn't backed down first, I feel like you would have taken me out. Doesn't matter. It could have played out a dozen different ways. Main thing is we stop the coup and Cerberus is off the Citadel. Yeah, but sometimes the way a thing goes down does matter, Shepard. Later when you have to live with yourself. Knowing that you acted with integrity. But it matters. You're talking about Udina. He gave me no choice, so I took the shot. Any soldier would have done the same. Including you. <sighs> okay. Admiral Hackett has just offered me a position on his team. Major, that's not the right team for you. Hackett can't have you. We need you here. Your abilities, your strength of character. Let's take on the Reapers together. Let's get it done. Well, I... Uh... <laughs> well, when you put it that way... Thank you, Commander. Absolutely. I'm in. And Shepard, I need you to know that I'll never doubt you again. I get you back. Good to know. Welcome aboard, Major. Aye, aye, ma'am. Shepard, I got Anderson patched in. I was just getting him up to speed. Odina? That SOB was always power-hungry. But this? He wasn't in charge. Cerberus was just using him to take control of the Citadel. What the hell for? I don't know. Not yet. Could have been a lot worse. Shepard stopped the assassination attempt on Counselor Ashiel. Kyline. What? Your assassin. I'll have Hackett send you my reports on him. I take it you two have met. Kaylee Sanders and I had our share of run-ins with him. I shot him in both legs once. Thought that might be the end of him. But he should have begun on Omega even stronger. Elusive man patch him up? That'd be my guess. Given what they were able to do with you and Grayson, it's a safe bet Lang's even more dangerous now. I don't care who he is. Next time we meet, he dies. Their attempts may have had at least one unintended side effect. I received word from the Asari counselor. They're requesting an update on the Crucible. Lang has them scared. Enough to send help? Hmm. Yes, the Asari and Solarians are both throwing in their support now. How's your progress on the Crucible? Good. Our estimates suggest we've completed nearly 50% of the known work. So quickly. Once decoded, the schematics are designed in such a way that allows our scientists to easily translate the information. It's not Prothean-specific. Hmm. Are we any closer to understanding how to use it? That's still open for debate. Utilized in the right fashion, our scientists are convinced it can generate enough energy to destroy the Reapers. The question is, how will it dispense the energy? And in what form? You mean, how do you stop it from wiping us all out? Exactly. We think the catalyst is the key to determining how to focus its energy, how to direct its energy at the Reapers alone. I'm working on that. You'll find the answer, Shepard. I'll send you an update on the schematics. And in the meantime, we'll keep building. And we'll keep fighting. 
Make sure there's an Earth left to come back to. Cerberus, Reapers. They'll all pay for this war. One way or another. We're still in this. The gods of war haven't given up on us yet. Good luck, both of you. Anderson out. Commander, the Tyrian fleet is stretched thin. We need more support ships. And Aquarians are willing to talk. Understood, sir. I'll look into it. Be careful. We've got reports of instability along the Geth border. Hack it out. Shepard, do you have a moment? A contact within Asari High Command was insistent I pass on a distress signal to you. Something they can't handle? From what I can tell, they sent several commando squads to investigate. None of them returned. They didn't ask me directly, but I think High Command is hoping you might help. What's your take on this? That they wouldn't ask for help if it wasn't important. The colony's coordinates are on the galaxy map. I'll try to figure out what's going on.
Commander, I've got a lead on something interesting. Have you got a minute? Commander, I've found something you need to see. What have you got? A group of Cerberus scientists cut ties and fled. Perhaps they finally realized they were on the wrong side. We don't know what they were researching, but they were among the elusive man's top scientists. They could help build the Crucible. Unless they're indoctrinated and this is a ruse to get Cerberus close to the Crucible. I'm not suggesting we trust them fully, but it could be worth investigating. Has the Alliance tried to make contact with the scientists? They've been unable to find them, but they're searching. As is Cerberus. I've been monitoring Cerberus communications. I've charted signal frequency from various Cerberus cells by location and cross-referenced known ship movements. You found them? I believe so, yes. Nice work. Put it on the map and I'll give it a look. It's on the map now, Commander. Thanks.
Commander, Dr. Chuck was sent word that she'd like to speak with you down in the med bay. 